Hello and welcome to a new video. In today's video we are going to take a look at Microsoft Word. We are going to focus on the styles of Microsoft Word. What some people may experience when they are editing a Word document is that some of the styles that they have gotten familiar to may be missing from the styles bar over here. And there are two reasons for this. And one reason is simply that Word doesn't load all of them. And to get access to all of the styles, what you have to do is you have to go to the bottom right corner of this styles pane. I'm not sure if you can see it. I can't make it any better. It's this very small icon on the top right corner right here. And you have to click that. And it will open the styles pane, which was already open for me. It may be named differently in your language. And what you then have to do next, you can see that I have a full overview, but you may be seeing fewer headers and options. What you do next is go to the bottom. Keep in mind that your button may be placed elsewhere, depending on the position of your styles pane. Click the options button. And then you will have the option select styles to show. This defines what styles you can see and it will be usually set to recommend it. But what you have to do then is click on all styles and then click OK. That will add the rest of the missing headings and the likes to your styles pane which will make them available over here. Now I did say that there were two reasons why you're not seeing all the styles and the second one isn't something you can switch off or change but the reason is that some of the styles options only become available if you use parent styles if that makes sense for example you have headings from 1 to 9 but they are not all displaying they will only start displaying if you are using parent headings for example if I have a heading 1 and a heading 2, the next heading will then become available like 5 and 6 or 7 and 8. And this applies to quite a few styles. And some of them might be hidden behind it because Microsoft's logic is that you don't need a heading 9 if you don't have a heading 3 applied. You can think about that what you want, but that is how Microsoft Word works at the moment and that is why you can see all the styles that and the fact that some of them are hidden in the styles options and that you have to enable them all that is it for today's video we are not going to stress this video any longer than we have to we hope you enjoyed this video and we'll see you next time goodbye